What's going on guys, it's the Crazy Minecrafter back with another single player mods episode and this single player mods episode is actually Premium Wood by uh, Skokeeve9, really awesome mod and he has just updated it so there is now two more trees in, so that is a total of three new trees that this mod adds plus a ton more possibilities for building. As you can see I built some sort of, I just, it doesn't look the nicest but I tried to use as many, as many different blocks as I could and um... Yeah, it looks like, as you can see, you can make some really, really cool buildings out of this new mod. And, uh, yeah, this floor is just made out of um, the magic wood um, uh, workbenches. And then uh, we got the um, we got all the different types of bookshelves right here. And as you can see, there's um, this one is the uh, silver bell, maple, magic, and then those are the white uh, birch, sorry, and uh, pine. As you can see, I, I think, yeah, I mixed that up uh, well, but... <laughs> and there's the different crafting tables. As you can see, the original one is here, and uh, the maple one looks sort of similar to it, but uh, a little bit different. And also, he cleaned up the workbenches, so they do look a, a little bit nicer than they uh, originally did, uh, which I noticed right away. And, uh, but anyways, I, I know you guys want to check out what the silver bell tree and the maple tree looks like. So the silver bell tree is a sort of rare tree, I believe. I think he fixed it so there is a lot more. Uh, this world was generated before there was a fix for that, but I'm sure that there's a lot more generated because he said he did fix that. And uh, we got the maple trees here, which are generating all over the place. As you can see, they're pretty much supposed to be like a new... Um, and uh, just basically a new thing that fits in perfectly with it and it looks very nice and it just looks like it fits in Minecraft perfectly like it just could be added in right now that's exactly what it looks like and as you can see the darker kind of wood look in there and it looks really nice um, also um, we have the magic tree over here the leaves are look a little bit weird right now I'm not sure if they're gonna be changed because I believe he just did change the leaf texture um, but yeah and then we have, I uh, just put another pretty much demonstration of them. The leaves look really nice on these silver bell trees. And in the future, I believe he's going to be adding a, a certain drop for the silver bell trees, which is, uh, I'm not too sure what he's going to add yet. Um, but anyways, we still have, um, we have the half steps for pretty much everything, even the logs. So like, let's say I go and grab, um, let's grab two of these. And I believe it's two, is it three? No, it is three. So wait, let's craft a crafting table, or I could just use some over there. And then let's grab some more. And yeah, I'll just place it here. Um, basically, when you put three like this, you get uh, your slabs, if you're wondering. I Hopefully most of you should have known that. But anyways, also we have uh, pretty much, I just want to show you what every type of tree adds. It adds a new type of stick and new boats. And all the new boats look very cool. Just shift-click these things in here. And... Uh, go throw all these out. Oops, I didn't even mean to get that in that one. But that oh my god, I keep getting in them. Uh yeah, and so as you can see the birch, it does look a uh, different from this. I actually didn't get the birch one, the birch boat, sorry. So I'm going to get that. Here we are. I think this is the birch. No, that isn't the birch. There's the birch. Okay. So the birch doesn't look the same if you guys were wondering. It uh, it does look different from the silver bell tree. More of a silverish color to that. It also adds in fences for all of the new ones. So we got the original fences, the um, birch, the magic, the maple, the silver bell, and uh, the dark wood. So yeah. And uh, also, I just I didn't really go over this, and I want to go over this before what uh, the magic tree adds in. The magic tree is um, is more unique. Um, so I want to just show that quickly. So basically, the magic tree is used um, actually to create some really awesome tools. So first, let me just get out of too many items. And let's, I'll just uh, kind of show you everything I want to, I just want to show everything. Oops, I dropped it. And there we go. Okay, so pretty much first I want to show you how to craft the tools. And uh, the tools are pretty durable and they're good. They're, I think they're, I believe they're better than stone. I'm pretty sure they are. So as you can see, uh, you cannot craft them with, you need, uh, and I repeat, need the magic sticks. Because if you try and do this, you just get a normal axe. And you don't want to waste your magic wood on that since uh, it is a fairly rare spawning and um, pretty awesome. So uh, as you can see, it does go really fast and really good for uh, for uh, that kind of axe that can be found by a tree, which is sort of rare. And also, what uh, what Skokie did to make it perfectly balanced is uh, so you don't just keep getting trees. Is like I'm not sure the exact ratio now. I believe he changed it, but. And most of the time, the tree will explode when you try and uh, 
when you try and grow it. As you can see, it grew there. And yeah, it is a little bit glitched, the leaves, just because it's touching the blocks here. So I'm sure that'll be fixed. But yeah, it's just because they're touching the blocks. If it wasn't touching, then you wouldn't be able to see through the ground. But yeah. And uh, yeah, it's actually really uh, really hard to grow uh, the trees. So that's, that's something nice so that you don't just uh, pretty much... <laughs> just spam them and keep getting tools like that and you don't even have to mine and stuff like that so that's really cool and uh, the last thing I want to say was there's uh, also some unobtainable items at the moment which you can get through too many items uh, I just thought I would mention that in case you guys wanted it for those of you who use too many items uh, it's basically half doors and um, yeah so there's half doors for everything that cannot be placed beside each other I forgot about that and they turn into full doors once they're broken so <laughs> something to uh, keep in mind. So really, really cool actually. It would be nice, uh, some gates would be really cool. I know they have tons of mods like that. But yeah. Um, but anyways, that was pretty much it for this mod, guys. And actually, wait, no, I want to show one more thing. Um, this one thing cannot actually be obtained through uh, too many items. I was actually discovering this because there's a, a glitch at first. This actually might be taken out because of the new update. But um, uh, if you do, do give type in single player commands, give 17 and then 664. As you can see, I just got some birch, which are all around birch. I don't know that, I honestly have no idea. Um, I guess uh, Skokie added that in. I'm not too sure, uh, pretty sure that's um, what I'm assuming. And uh, yeah, it doesn't act like normal wood. Just something uh, pretty cool. And uh, I thought I would mention that in case any of you guys want to build with it. And uh, I just thought I would throw that out here, out there. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, please remember to comment, rate, and subscribe for some more videos, and uh, maybe leave suggestions in case uh, Skokeeve is looking for any, any more things to add in, uh, just go ahead and leave some suggestions below. Later guys.